Hi, it's Callie from the Crafty Girls, and today I'm going to show you how to make this Annabeth from the Percy Jackson series. The supplies you will need are one loom, you can use any kind of loom for this, one hook, a holding hook, if you don't have a holding hook that's okay, but if you do I suggest using one, skin tone for her skin, I'm using the tan in the skin tone pack, gray for her eyes, blue for her ponytail, white for her shoes, navy blue or you can also use ocean blue for her pants, orange for her shirt, and yellow for her hair. And without further ado, let's get started. First we're going to make the neck, so take two skin tone bands and put them from here to here. Now take two more and go from here to here and repeat on the other side. Now we're going to start on the shirt, so take two orange and go down. And we're going to repeat that two more times. So in all we have gone down three times. And now we're going to repeat that on the other two rows. Okay, now press your bands down, and now we're going to start on the pants. So take two of your pant color, which should be navy blue to make it look more like jeans, and go down four times. And now we're going to repeat that on the other side. Now push those bands down. And now take one take two shoe colors and place them from here to here and repeat on the other side and now we're going to do this part of the shoe, the bottom part so take your band and twist four times just like a cat band but instead of just two, four times if you can't do that then just do three but if you can then really try to do four And now we'll add some holding rubber bands. Take one of your shirt color, double it like this, and now make a triangle on these three pegs. And repeat that again. Now take another orange band, double it, place it from here, go over this peg, and then connect it to that one. Now we're going to make the arms. So take your hook, take one skin tone band, and loop it four times. Now take two skin tone, put them here, and pull this band over. Now Repeat that two more times. And now take two orange rubber bands and do the same thing. and then repeat that one more time. And now 
place that on the shoulder peg. And now we're going to do the same thing for the other side. And if I'm ever going too fast for you, then fast, then just pause the video and then fast forward. And if I'm going too slow, then just fast forward. Then once you're done with that, just connect that to the other side. And your loom should look like this. Now we can start looping. So go under the cap band, curve the bottom two whites, and pull them over. And now do that same thing all the way up the leg. Now repeat on the other side. Now grab these two bands and just pull them over and then continue all the way up. And now go under this band and just go up the sides. And if you do not like me holding my loom like this, it just seems a little bit easier to hook, but I can do it on the ground, so if it seems hard for you to see, then just comment below about that. Now, Go under all these bands, grab the bottom two, which should be your skin tone, and pull to the center. And repeat on the other side. Now I'm very careful with this, so your bands do not break. Go under all those bands, grab the bottom two skin tone, and pull over. Now, if you have a holding hook, then go under these two bands and just pull it off. If you do not, then just start at the bottom and leave these two bands here. But I do have a holding hook, so I'm going to do it this way. And there's your body. And now we're going to start on the head. So take two yellows and place them from here to here. And if your body is still attached, then just skip one row of pegs and start here. Okay. And now repeat that on the other side. Now take two more yellows and go down once on each side. Now take two skin tone, go from here to here, and repeat on the other side. Now in the middle, go down two times with your skin tone. And now with two skin tone, go from center to the side, like that. And then repeat on the other side. Now we're going to do the eyes. So take one of your eye color. I'm using gray because her eyes are really gray. If you want to use black, that's okay. And then just go in this peg, two down, like this, one, two, and then loop four times, like a cat band. And press that band down and repeat on the other side.
Now, take one skin tone band and just make a triangle. And now, don't go under this band, but go around it. And take these bands and just pull them up. You can go one at a time or all at once. It doesn't matter as long as all the bands go over that one skin tone band. And now we're going to do her ponytail. So take your hook, take one yellow, loop it three times. Now take another yellow and bring that band over. And from here on out, it's pretty much just a single bracelet that you're making on the hook. And we're going to go up about five times. So that's two. And it's just your opinion on how long you want to go. But I'm just going to go five. And now that you have four, on your last one, you're going to take your blue band for the ponytail and just do that again. And now, connect this to here. Now, add your body. So take these and place them here. And now, Pull your body back, grab the top two bands, and pull them to the side where they came from. And repeat on the other side. Now just go up the middle. Now go under all these bands, grab the bottom two, and pull up. And just go up again. Now repeat on the other side. And now just the same as the shoulders, bring them to the center. Now take a single yellow band and we're just going to make a slip knot. So go under all these bands, grab this yellow, and then pull the side over and then tighten it. And now you can take it off the loop. And now you gotta toy around with her a little bit to make her look better. And pull her eyes out. And now, if you want to leave her as a charm, then leave this band out. But if you don't, which I don't, then take your hook go in these bands from the back, grab this band, and just pull it through, which might be a little hard. And there's your Annabeth. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe. Bye.